1963 split window Corvette. The other end, 441, 162 miles an hour. Cameron, went a 432 one and qualified and landed her in the number seven spot. Many orders are 438.3. Attention to the Penary, please, the lead top sportsman we need you to the Super Bowl. Look at that, 434, 162 miles an hour. Take down your number two qualifier. And that'll bring up Ryan Warner and Sam Friel. Ryan Warner here on the left hand side. Ryan Warner, Sam Friel into the beams. And the old school is full Camaro. to Friels, your number six qualifier at 437.
and the bottom fell out. I'm sure you notice cars being sent off into the doom and gloom of a coming summer evening thunderstorm with lightning flashing and thunder rolling. Well, that last pair in which you saw, they caught the rain. They reacted to the red flashing lights, which signifies stop racing, but they launched, no time. We've got to pick up with the action for the rest of round two with those two cars because a massive storm rolled into Virginia Motorsports Park and pushed racing to Sunday. By the way, folks, when you're finished watching Pro 632 in this video, be sure to catch the other action from yours truly, the Monday Morning Racer. There are Extreme Pro Stock, Pro Nitrous, and Pro Boost elimination videos from the PDRA Summer Shootout presented by Tie Drive. The rest of round two, next. number two on the year. Do you definitely think that makes a statement to old Wes that you're here to play to get a championship in Outlaw 632? Well, I hope so. I mean, it was, 
we uh, went, went 4 double o on the semi round, on, on our buy round, kind of in the semi. We had to buy into the final. We got lucky there, and we went 4 0 and my buddy called me on the phone, so I think you just burned up your luck there, but we still, we luckily, we, we got them on the tree, and that's what how we won that race, so thank God it it paid off, and it's, uh, it's a good feeling, there's no doubt. The driver getting it done inside and on the tree for the win here at the PDRA Summer Shootout. Congratulations, Daryl. Hey, thank you very much. I just want to say thank you very much to Daryl Hamitman at HRE Racing Engines. I forgot to put him in there last time because without that, we wouldn't even be here. And then Clayton Murphy at Chassis Engineering, who absolutely put this whole deal together. And I haven't driven in 25 years, so he had this happen, and it's it's been a great feeling, so we're happy to be here.